The Supreme Court on August 2 told the central and state governments to deploy additional police or paramilitary forces and install CCTV cameras in all sensitive areas to prevent any violence during the protest marches in Delhi. This directive comes as the Vishwa Hindu Parishad and Bajrang Dal staged protest marches in different locations across Delhi following communal violence in Haryana's NU. On the morning of August 2, dozens of people belonging to the Hindutva outfit gathered at Badarpur Toll and blocked the national highway. During the protest, the demonstrators chanted slogans like Jai Shri Ram, Har Har Mahadev and Vande Matra. According to Delhi police officials, no permission was sought for the rally or meeting at a public place. Taking cognizance of the matter, 60 policemen were deployed to monitor the situation. Meanwhile, the Supreme Court hearing a plea against the protest by Hindu outfits has asked Delhi police, UP and Haryana governments to ensure there is no hate speech in the rallies against any community or violence or damage to property to deploy additional force where needed and videograph events in all sensitive areas. This protest by Hindu outfits is being staged against the violence which erupted on July 31 during the Bridge Mandal Jalabhishek Yatra organized by Bajrang Dal and VHP in Nu, a district with a Muslim majority. Prior to this event, the district was already tense due to messages on social media of the alleged participation of Monu Manasar in the Yatra. Monu is a self-proclaimed cow vigilante and Bajrang Dal leader accused of being involved in the abduction and murder of two Muslim men in February 2023. On August 1, the violence spread to Gurugram where a mob of approximately 80 people set fire to a mosque resulting in the tragic death of young Naib, Imam of the mosque. Additionally, several shops were vandalized and set ablaze in the district. In the end, six people lost their lives, including two policemen, and more than 50 others were injured. The situation remains tense, though the police said curfew was relaxed for some time in Nu. In Nu, the police have registered 26 FIRs and arrested 116 individuals related to the violence. In Gurgaon, 15 FIRs were registered on July 31 and August 1. As of now, 8 people have been arrested and 30 others have been detained in connection with the violence. Haryana Chief Minister Manohar Lal Khattar has strongly condemned the attack on the Bajrang Dal Yatra in Nu, terming it as a planned and conspired act. He has promised strict action against the culprits responsible for the violence. He also appealed to the public to maintain peace and brotherhood. Subscribe to the Federal's YouTube page for more news and updates.